Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, go ahead and hit that subscribe button at the bottom of your screen. And don't forget to hit the bell as well so you're notified whenever I upload a video. Okay, so as promised, I am here today to do a 30 day update on me using the rice water rinse in my hair. And I know that I can talk for days, so I'm just gonna get right into it and measure my hair first so you guys can see where my hair is now. Um, it has been a little bit over a month. Today is May 8th, so it's been a month and six days, so you know, 36 days since I started the rice um, water rinse. And if you saw my previous video, matter of fact, let me just go ahead and link that up here for you. Um, if you saw my previous video, in that video, I use the rice water rinse every day for 10 days. After that 10 day mark, I did not use the rice water, water rinse every 10 days. I just used it on my wash days. And you guys, oh, I love it. Okay, but listen, do you see what I almost just did? I almost just kept on talking, but let me go ahead and, <laughs> and measure my hair right now. Okay. So, I'm gonna do this side. And, where's my brush at? My brush. And, oh, you guys can't see. It'd be nice if you guys could see, right? This is where my hair is today. I'm, I'm trying to make my hair, my hair, my head straight so you guys can see. This is 30 days, you guys. Where's my pin at so I can mark my hair? Uh, of course, I dropped my pin. Okay, let's go ahead and mark it. does not work. We're just gonna go back to the pink pen, so. Hair head straight, boop. Where are we at? Right here. You guys. This is day 30. Wow, so. My hair started right here when I, before I even started the rice water rinse. My hair started right here. This is 10 days, you guys. This is 30 days. Can you believe it? All right, you guys, so now the measurement is out of the way. I'm gonna share with you some of the things that I've definitely seen, positives that I've seen throughout the last 30 days of using the rice water rinse. And the number one thing on my list is fallout. Prior to using the rice water rinse, whenever I would detangle on my wash days, my comb would be full of hair. Now it's virtually non-existent. Of course there's some hair in my comb, but it's nowhere near where it was prior to using this rice water rinse. My hair seems to be stronger, a lot more elasticity, smoother, silkier, and of course the actual hair growth that's come along with it as well. And now that I know after doing actual research on the rice water itself, knowing that it has vitamin E, vitamin B, um, antioxidants, minerals in it, I'm gonna continue to use this every wash day. Cause I haven't seen any negatives to this, only positives. I haven't seen any uh, buildup on my scalp. I haven't seen any dry skin, no flakes. I've only seen positives. So, I have seen some videos that are kind of negative about the rice water rinse, but like I said, for me, no negatives I have I experienced thus far. So yeah, this is just a short little video to tell you where I'm at after 30 days, and I'm doing great by the length of my hair, you guys. Like, bam, look at that. This is where I started. This is where I am after 30 days, well, 36 days, and I'm just, 
loving it. So if you like this video and you like an update every month as to see where my hair is in length or how my hair is responding to the rice water rinse, let me know and I'll continue to do one or I'll update every month for you guys to see. Hopefully this wasn't a long video. I'm trying to talk as fast as I can. If you like this video though, give me a thumbs up. Go ahead and subscribe. Leave comments below and I'll see you in the next one. Bye y'all.